What's up YouTube, it's your boy Douglas M. And I'm back again to uh, do another video on my Samsung Note 10.1. Um, I got it rooted, as you can see there, I'm a super user. Um, didn't want to do it, but looks like I had to. Um, just go over and we'll just test out. I never really did uh, to see if it actually does work. Um, I did download a program. Uh, let me zoom in here. It's called GL to SD. I don't know if it's a cost or not. I, I don't know. If, I don't know if it's free or not. So, but I have it. And uh, you guys, they, I think that I think it is a cost, but I think they have a free version. I believe. Not sure. But you guys will find that out. It's in Google Play. Um, so let me go into the store. And I'm, what I want to do, well, actually, before, I'm going to download this game here. It's called uh, Jetpack Joyride. But before, actually, before I do that, let's go into the settings and let's go into storage. Um, where is that? There we go. Let's go into storage. So let's see what we got here. So available is... 4.6 gigabytes and I use 2.83 yeah of apps and my SD card all right it's 26 um, 0.40 uh, gig gigabytes available okay just want to know that so we'll I'm gonna download something and get back. I'm, I, actually, I'm going to look for a big file to download because I don't think that game was bad. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I want to download a real big one. Uh, give me one second. All right. Well, instead of that other game I mentioned, I'll just go ahead and download Nova 3. And uh, it looks like that's going to be a while to download. That's a big game. So we'll, we'll be able to see a difference there. Uh, I'll come back when it's done. I um, don't want to sit here and have you guys wait. Well, finally, um, I finished downloading it. Let's go back to uh, my storage and see where we're at there uh, to compare from where we um, initially was before I downloaded uh, this uh, game. So let's go to our storage. Okay, so that's where we're at. We're uh, I got available 2.97 gigabytes of um, storage space, and just to show you my memory card is at the same spot because I didn't move it there yet so let's let's go ahead and do it now one thing I didn't check which would be funny is if this file can't be removed to um, <laughs> the SD uh, then it would this whole video would be a fail well if that happened I wouldn't release it anyway so let me see here all right so oh okay well let me let me get out of this anyway all right, so I'm going to go into the program, um, or the app, should I say. It's called GL to SD, like I said. Um, let me move this up here. Boom. All right, so we'll go ahead and click it. And, okay, move data. All right. So, oh, whoo, that was close. <laughs> it's the last one. So I'm going to see where it says Nova 3. I'm going to uh, click that box, which would create a check mark. And you see where it says move, right? So on the top, it says move game data to external SD. So we're going to hit move. And we'll go ahead and wait on that. That probably is going to take a while. So I'll hit pause. Um, yeah, it'll probably take about two minutes or so. Give me one moment. Okay, about time. Whew. Man, that thing took like three, four, it took about five minutes, really. So, uh, it did it. So, let me clear out of there. And we're going to go to our storage. Oh, my battery life is going down. I got 7% left. Let me hurry up. Let's charge this for later. All right. Um. Oh, what am I doing? Let me go to my storage again and see what happens. Storage, where are you there? And let's zoom in a little and see what we got. Uh, let's see. Okay, so I don't know if you could see it, but it, uh, yeah. So we're back at well, we got uh, four point six one gigabytes available, right? 
of uh, storage um, internally. So let's go down to the memory card. So now we're down to 24. So that's proof um, that it did it. Okay. So uh, that's pretty awesome. So we know that works. Um, so let's go ahead and look at the game. Where, where is it here? I'll go ahead and put it in. Test it out. Nova 3. I heard this is a good game. I'll test it out a little bit. Since it's running from the memory card, let's make sure. And that's another thing I wanted to show you guys too, because you can move apps all you want to your memory card. Does it work when it's on there? That's that's the second question you need to ask. Because some of these file managers that you might use or a different technique, um, you may use it. Move it, but can you load it from there? That's an, you know. That's what I just wanted to make sure. My volume is up. Okay, so it's it's loading something here right here okay it's loading these big games it just loads a lot <clears throat> but um okay well anyway that's the gist of this video I wanted to just see and you know what I'll do just for extra credit I'll make it because it's loading something I don't know if it's unpacking something I don't know but I'll go back to my storage I'm gonna pause it again I'm gonna go back to my storage when it finishes just to make sure if anything go went up because and you guys answer me uh, this question because you you guys would know uh, there's some techies that happen to run through my um, certain videos and and they can answer this so if you this is my question if you put something on your memory card like I did now and you know like when you start the game it says it has to retrieve other information does that other information also download to the memory card since it's already there? That question I don't know. I, I don't think it really matters, but I, it's just a question I wanted to know. But let me go ahead and pause this, um, and I'll get back when it's when it's finished. Wow, this is really unbelievable. But I think we're almost done now. Just to give you an example of how big that file is it took like five minutes <laughs> to download and now it's hitting me with installing wow this is a this has got to be the biggest game I have for real it took like five minutes to download the extra whatever it was so I heard this game was worth it I've always wanted it and I didn't want to play it on my phone I like playing games like this on my phone even though what is this S3 4.7 or 4.8 the screen size I don't know even if it was 5 like the like the Note 2 that phone or phablet whatever they call it which I won't be getting I'm, I'm waiting for the S4 but um I don't like playing games like that on, on the phone I, I, I'd rather play it on a big screen like 10 not even a 7 is like a 10 10.1 you know I don't know that's just me Heck, I'd really rather play the Xbox or 360, to be honest with you. And stay tuned, too. Um, I pre-ordered the Wii U, so I'll be having that. Um, I'll be having that all tricked out when I get mine. and So stay tuned uh, for that as well in November. All right, I'm going to hit pause again while this is stalling again. Um, I'll be right back. All right, it looks like finally um, it is finished. Thank goodness. All right, so let's quickly go to our storage and see if anything has changed, which would probably answer my question. Ha ha. So right now it went down to 2.21. So, huh. Let me see that there. So let me go back into the program then. I'm probably going to have to move. Maybe I should have waited and then moved it. You know, uh, upload everything or download everything and then move it. Okay. So, as you can see there, I got to move it again. <laughs> that is hilarious. Okay. So, let's... That is funny. 
And so I like this app too. It is like app, um, app to SD. I mean, it's showing you what it can move. If it couldn't move it, it wouldn't be there. Like I think there was, I think Angry Birds space. I have all three Angry Birds. I don't know if there's any more of that, but I have the Angry Birds and the Angry Birds season or whatever you call it, and the Angry Birds space. Well, Angry Birds space was the only one that I can move to my SD. So this does separate what you can and what you cannot move. So um, just to let you know that it just doesn't list everything you got. And then, you know, so that 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 is cool about this. And I really wish I didn't have to root my uh, well, I don't care at this point, but I, I, I thought I was done with all that with those uh you know shenanigans and rooting and doing all that but i will do uh, since i do have a root i will um look into getting something for the battery life um to to uh help that out i don't know what i gotta do but i'll ask my boy on that i haven't checked that out in a while but it, since it's rooted i might as well take advantage of that so i'll pause it again and when it's done i'll get back to you and we'll see if uh, everything has moved. So I guess if this does work, then they, I guess then it's best to, you know, load the game. Make you know, make sure everything is downloaded, all the extra stuff, and then just do it one time. I guess that would be the best way, especially if you're running down on um, um, hard drive space like I am. I only have two gigs right now, so. So that's cool. All right, I'll be back. All right, all right, that's done. So let's come out of that, uh, hit home, and let's go ahead also and um, we'll clear out everything. I don't know why I'm doing this, but I'm doing it anyway. And all. Uh, clear out that. I don't know why so many apps run in the background. That's one. Maybe that's another thing I can do. Take care of since I'm rooted. Yeah. Well, that would probably that that's hand in hand with the uh, battery life. All right. So let's see. So storage. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. <clears throat> mm hmm. Interesting. So it my storage still went down though. It still went down. I mean it it didn't go all the way back up to what I started out with before I got the program. And this is my uh memory card right there. So it's down to 23.99. Okay. Well, it worked. Uh it's uh, well clearly as you can see it's not 100%, but um It'll do. Well, here's what I'm gonna do. Let me come out of here before I go. Uh, go here. And I was gonna uninstall it, but never mind. I'll I'll just keep it. But anyway, that is a quick review of. Um, the app of the what is it called again the gl the sd uh sd um it does work um and uh that's that's pretty much it i probably be doing there there's another way to do it too where you can swap out um you can reverse roles you can make your memory card your your hard your main hard drive like your internal hard drive so in other words the 16 gigabyte hard drive there's an app when it's rooted where you can flip flop it so my 16 would be my external to the tab, and then my 32 gigabyte would be the main hard drive. I'm gonna do that when I get a 64, and I think that would pr probably best solve my problem here. Because I don't, don't like having three gigs of space left, but although I don't think I'll be putting too much more on the memory card, I mean, I'm um, on the internal memory, internal storage should I say so I think we should be good there anyway I, th I don't think I'll be putting anything more so but anyway that's it uh, we're almost at 15 minutes and I really don't want to go further uh, but thanks for viewing uh, leave comments and suggestions and other things that you may know that I don't because I'm not really big into rooting I really don't care but 
it might be some insight that you may have uh, that you can share with me and as well as others uh, that help us through this crap that Samsung is pulling on us. Anyway, hit like if you like it. Thanks for at least uh, watching. Uh, remember to subscribe and your boy is out.